very much so Beyonce. Beyonce, Beyonce, Beyonce. what's poppin welcome back to another video blog um i'm vlogging off my new camera it is the sony v zv1 i believe it is i don't know i had ordered it because Aliyah says she likes it so i had got it in the mail a couple weeks ago and yeah so y'all yeah, been loving the quality on this so we're gonna just roll with it okay and i like the quality as well it's a very very hd 4k all that so yes yeah, so if you're new here hey girl my name is kyra and don't forget to like comment and subscribe so before we even get into any of the activities in today's vlog of course we have a hair sponsor shout out to julia hair company for sponsoring this video so this is the wig i'm about to put on it's so cute y'all this is my first time ever putting a color wig on so i'm pretty excited so this is the wig i the only thing that i did so far to it was bleach the knots but it was already bleached but i bleached them again because it came pre-bleached and also it's pre-plucked so yeah so i hope this looks good because i had i had actually looked up the best settings for this camera so hopefully it's cute this is the wig it's very much beyonce vibes <laughs> um but yeah it's so beautiful i've been trying to actually dye hair like this but this is how it comes it comes dyed just like this but i did um dye the roots dark just because light hair on me i don't know i just like a dark root so that's what i did but i didn't do anything else it's so beautiful i just washed it so this is what I'm going to put on right now. So let's get into it. I'm about to set y'all up real quick so I can put this on and let's get it going. You get the bag and fumble it. I get the bag and flip it and tumble it. Straight off the lot, 300 cash and the car came with a blood in it. The mama a thot and she got ass and she gon' fuck up a bag. Pull up to the spot, living too fast, dropping the dump in the stash. In Italy, got too far and hold that DMV. Drive the top. But you feel the heat yeah. Be real with me Keep it 100 Just be real with me Eat it up like it's a feast Ooh. They say the dope on fleek yeah. Percocet pill on me Percocet. I saw my nigga baby chill with me Them niggas that pussy in the back Don't say nothing Them niggas a kill for me Back as I count on my sleep On fleek Man, I can't spit on that paddy for leave For leave my dog in my tree Hop out the frog and leap I put them bricks in the fender My bitch she walk around like she Chris Jenner I used to break in the emblem They think I run it like the game of temple It's simple I play with a mental Mama said she saw me on Jimmy Kimmel Canada cause I'm a money sample Walking with the rats I'm looking crippled Fuck on that bitch then I temple A nigga for me to take pictures Not from LA but I clip her Double my cup or triple Box on my body no biblical I'm not your average or typical Look at my wrist and it's critical Hold it up, drop in the temperature I get that back on the regular I got a bag on my cellular Back in the bag of them vegetables Back of them cookies, it's medical Cocaine, codeine, etc. Cocaine and lean, it's federal I think I'm blending on Nebula I think that's when it ends on my schedule You get the bag and fumble it I get the bag and flip it and tumble it Straight up a lot, put on the cash And the car came with a blood in it La mama a thot, and she got ass And she gon' fuck up a bag Pull up to the spot Living too fast, dropping the dump in the stash In Italy, got too far and hoes they DM me Draw the top, when it's cold but you feel the heat Be real with me, keep it 100, just be real with me Eat it up like it's a feast, Eat it up. they say the dope on fleek I know these niggas get sick of me, the chance on my neck cause I'm ill a piece I don't need like a freestyle for free, I put in that key and I ride the beat I don't need come out the house for free I pay a nigga to drive for me JJ couldn't even go sign for me I do what I want cause I'm signed to me I get that, I get that, I get the bag They get the bag, have to cut it in half Top to cut parent, y'all making me laugh Need to rehab, I'm addicted to cash Convertible walk, convertible top My dope got a vertical, look at it how Scrap, 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 and then jump out the pot Came out the jail and went straight to the top Take it easy, baby Little, little summer, I'm teasing, baby Don't leave me, baby Just drop to your knees and please me, baby I'm fascinated just so far that I masturbated Congratulations She brought me so good that I graduated They had to hate it I don't fuck with them niggas, they catch the baby A trapper, baby I rap what I own on my mouth, just baby It's 
trash, baby. I pull up and fuck up the trash, baby. A savage, baby. I'm killing these niggas, close cash, get baby. You get the bag and fumble it, I get the bag and flip it and tumble it. Straight off the lot, 300 cash, and the car came with a blood in it. Lil' mama a thot, and she got ass, and she gon' fuck up a bag. Pull up to the spot, living too fast, dropping the dump in the stash. In Italy, got too far, hoes they be on me. Draw the tension, she grown so good that I graduated. They had to hate it, I don't fuck with them niggas, they catch the baby. I'm trapper, baby. I rap what I own on my mouth, just baby. It's tragic, baby. Fuck up the traffic, baby A savage, baby I'm killing these niggas, close cash, get baby You get the bag and fumble it I get the bag and flip it and tumble it Straight off the lot, 300 cash And the car came with a blood in it Lil' mama a thot, and she got ass And she gon' fuck up a bag Pull up to the spot, living too fast Dropping the dump in the stash In Italy, got too far and hoes, they be on me Drop the top, when it's cold But you scared the heat Be real with me, keep it 100 Just be real it's a feast, eat it up. They said it don't want fleek. Yeah. Y'all, who I look like right now? Beyonce. I'm, a, you're just mad because I look like Beyonce. Beyonce, bitch. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, this is how the hair turned out. I love it so much. I'm really shook at myself for even putting this hair in because like i said this is my first time putting in color hair so shout out to julia hair for sponsoring this video and like i said this hair comes exactly like this dyed to the t the only thing i did was the root because i do like a dark root but yeah y'all this is so bomb <sighs> i'm loving this so yeah, y'all, make sure you check the description box below so you are able to get this wig. And shout out to them for sponsoring this video. So yeah, let's just hop right into the vlog. Hey y'all, what's poppin'? Welcome back to another video. Skin is on fleek. Period. So today, I'm just getting ready. It's about 3 o'clock. I have been having a busy morning trying to get stuff done. So right now, I'm going to just do my hair. I'm trying to lighten this scar with vitamin E. I mean, it's getting lighter, but it's uh, it's going to a little too slow for me, baby. Like, it, this needs to go. Every time I put my arm up, I just get so mad. So, if y'all have any scar recommendations, let me know because, girl, I need it, like, ASAP. I'm waiting on my new camera to come because I just ordered... Um, the Sony B something. I don't know. But I have a whole bunch of stuff that I need to show y'all. Ugh, this ain't no. <laughs> I have a whole bunch of stuff that I need to show y'all that I got in the mail. And then also I went to Sephora that I wanted to show y'all. So, and then also I have some P.O. boxes that I'm going to show y'all. But, yeah, so I'm going to show y'all the two things that I got and then the stuff from Sephora and then I'll probably save the P.O. Box unboxing until I get I know I have some more stuff so I can just wait so because I think most of this stuff in here is lashes because I was feeling around before I even you know so before I um transfer y'all over to the new camera I'm gonna show you this is the camera that I got because Aaliyah got this and I was like girl uh, how is it like oh my god because the only thing I didn't like about it is that this flips out to the side and girl I like to look at myself and just focus in you know what I'm saying so and this camera does it the G7X but this one doesn't and then the only thing I don't like about this is that it don't like so far is that this battery has to ma i'm trying to do something this battery okay <clears throat> anyway this battery this battery you need to keep in the camera to charge and it's annoying because i would rather have two batteries and you know switching it out and then I don't know maybe there's a battery charger for sony because i don't know if y'all know that the g7x this was the g7x look like the battery charger this is what i mean so you can just put it in there and then just keep swapping out the battery but that's the only complaint that i have about this so far but she loves it and y'all been complaining about my quality so i was like okay let me let me just invest so yeah so i'm about to 
put y'all in the new camera then her video quality is bomb like since she got it for her blog so i'm excited so yeah so i'm gonna transfer y'all to the new one and yeah oh my teeth look good period we in the new camera Ooh. sony all sony products soften your face but you're in a new camera hey girl and um i'm about to make my earrings now go give me some holes but i gotta figure out how to get all this stuff off the camera maybe it's because of this mic it's on there i don't know is that too much wait let me take some of the skin tight skin thing off because it's a little high oh that's way better because it was like making me look too much oh and if y'all like fruit pops everybody likes fruit pops you know these are from whole foods it's called good pop 100 percent fruit juice these are bomb i can't stop i need to look right here and it's just so hard oh i gotta get used to this <laughs> but yeah so i'm about to leave i'm about to i'm about to <laughs> Mm. okay anyway so i'm about to leave and i'm gonna go to home goods and uh somewhere to find a robe and then give me something of some food and then come back home and then y'all know beyonce coming out with her film tonight black is king i can't wait to watch it y'all know i love movies and y'all know i love beyonce she's she's that she's that girl okay period this beyonce is just that girl so i'm gonna watch that tonight and yeah we're just gonna vibe out tonight so yeah comment down below if you've seen the movie because obviously by the time this goes up y'all have seen it so yeah <laughs> i play too much but y'all this popsicle is good as fuck <laughs> oh, oh my god this camera is literally something to get used to but um i just been working all morning it's about 3 25 um i'm about to go take my instagram picture right now i just did a get ready with me get ready with me get ready with me on this look um so yeah so make sure y'all go check that video out so um after that i think i'm gonna stop at tj maxx to see if i can get um a white robe i think and then i think i'm gonna go pick me up a salad because i'm starving i gotta look at this not that i gotta pick me up a salad because i'm hungry wait let me make sure okay but yeah i'm gonna pick me up a salad because i'm hungry and then um maybe a green juice and then later i think i'm gonna go work out because i need to start I gotta open up my lungs, okay? And I haven't worked out. And then when I get home, I'm gonna show y'all everything that I was supposed to show y'all yesterday with the unboxing. Um, last night, I just didn't get into it. Um, I was just tired, so. But today, we're gonna get into it, so. When I get home, well, I'm gonna show y'all um, where I'm taking my Instagram picture at. It's so fucking cute. It's at the art museum. I've been wanting to go here and take my picture and yeah, so I think it's real nice in here. Um it's cute, it's different, it's aesthetics and so yeah. Um I hope I get the shot. I hope this is a quick in and out. So I haven't been to the art I haven't been to the uh, Milwaukee Art Museum, but it's so like artsy and I don't know, architectural, if that's a word, like really just modern and cute. So, yeah, so this is one of the locations I wanted to take my pick. And I have this sleek outfit on, so I wanted it to be like sleek background. So, yeah, so I'm gonna start recording once we get down to show y'all everything. It's gonna be so cute. Okay, so this is how it looks in here. Ain't it so cute? so cute in here so i might go inside oh and it's clear as fuck over here um it's real nice in the inside of the actual um 
museum so i don't know like but who really feels like paying for that shit but i like the lighting over here y'all this is what i love to do like i love why would i park all the way down here they gonna think i'm psycho hold on oh what's that little hallway y'all i'm always finding like little cute places to take my pig because i gotta fuck it up on a gram you know so yeah i'm just waiting for sean to come and take my pig anybody that takes my pig i pay them like i pay my sister she's the one that always takes my pigs so i have to pay her because that's just taking the time because I'm really picky about my pictures um especially right now um the last pictures I just took I feel like I set the tone back on my um Instagram because um girl I was slacking I was just doing some dumb shit on Instagram but now I feel like I'm back I'm setting the tone back and then you know yeah so yeah so yeah, I'm real picky, angles, all that. You need to get it on point. Don't play with me, cause I'm paying you for your time. And my time is money just like yours, you know what I'm saying? So, but let me call him and see where he at. Uh, Sean isn't here yet, but this is just something that I like to do just to see how my picture is gonna look. So I put the my phone like where I may, like the area may where I wanna take my pic just to make sure the lighting is good flash on flash off and see which one is better I think I'm feeling the flash off because it's already some good ass lightning here and it's more white so yeah so cute here I can't even take it <laughs> it's cute as fuck so Oh, let me show y'all my fit, the full fit. So, so this is what I got on. I got on this cute bodysuit. These Alexander McQueen's and my Louis bag. So, yeah, it's cute. He needs to hurry up. Why this man right here, right? I was literally just pumping gas. Oh wait, let me zoom out, hold on. Y'all, I was literally just pumping gas, right? And he was like, Krista? I was like, huh? And he was like, oh, I thought you were my friend Krista from Milwaukee. I'm like, what? Do I look like a Krista to you? And I don't know, you know, he probably, he looked like he be getting catfished, don't it? Ma. Mm. Don't. <laughs> oh, hey, oh my God, this quality is crazy as shit. But, um, okay, so the where we left off, I don't have no shirt on right now, so. Um, yeah, so where we left where we left off, I was at the gas station, right? Pumping gas. Then this man comes up to me. He's like, he's like, Christine? Christine! I was like, what? And he was like, oh, I thought you were my friend um, from Milwaukee, Christine. I was like, do I look like a fucking Christine? That has to be a fake page. There's no way. I never met a black girl named Christine. Ever. In my life so i think somebody is catfishing this man it has to be her name gotta be christine on the internet y'all know how many fake pages there is and he looked like somebody that would fall for a catfish honestly but yeah now i'm at home um i was just doing content all day y'all i'm sleepy it's about 12 a.m it's about to be 12 o'clock so but oh my god i had panera's um chicken noodle soup y'all so good like everybody is known he they're known for their broccoli and cheddar but i can't have that right now 
So I just got chicken noodle soup. It was so good. But now I'm watching Double Shot of Love. I don't know if y'all know what this. I just started watching this. Um, I didn't watch it from the beginning though. I just randomly clicked it because I was watching one of my shows on MTV because I was bored. And I didn't have anything to watch. And I was like, fuck it, I'm going to just watch this. It's with that show. It's the show with Vinny and um, DJ Pauly D from Jersey Shore. I guess they on the show on here with their exes or something. This is my third episode I watched. And y'all know what? Pauly D is kind of cute. If I see him in person, I'm going to be like, hey. And he like black girls, bitch. Because this is the, his ex. This is the girl that be going crazy over him, I, I guess. <laughs> but yeah anyway so yeah so tomorrow's a new day i don't know what's gonna be planned tomorrow's friday saturday but yeah i'm about to get in the shower wash my makeup off take my wig off and call it outside because i'm tired oh i just gave you a deep sleep okay let me go i gotta go i gotta go bye <gasps> This quality is crazy. Y'all see my eyebrows? I go to sleep. Um, I just want to say, Aaliyah, if you're watching this, I'm so happy for you. You got your new home. I can't wait to come and visit, bitch. The fuck? Ah! No, I'm just kidding. But I'm just so happy for her. Like, she, y'all know she was going through all that mess and whatever. Um, I know y'all watch her. If y'all do not know her, you're living under a fucking rock. Cause that's my bitch. Um, queen consistency is like unmatched. Okay, period. So hardworking. Um, and I'm definitely always inspired by her. That's my friend. She's always so supportive. And yeah, she's like the best. Okay. Um... So yeah, y'all know that's my homegirl. And yeah, if you're watching this, I'm so happy for you. I'm so proud of you. Keep doing big things, boo. I love you. So, but yeah, um, now I'm going to go to in the shower. And <laughs> I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. I'm fucking crying. <laughs> y'all, this is not a fucking drill. Let me show y'all. Jackie Aina posted me on her fucking story! <laughs> Yo, I'm literally shook. I'm literally dead ass crying. I got pimples. Girl, stuff I'm like, on me, why but... is she crying? <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe this. <laughs> like me? No. <laughs> No, I'm not okay. I'm gonna write her and be like, "What? No!" <laughs> Start crying. No, I just don't understand. That was too damn funny. Uh, you okay? You gonna live? You wanna come back fifteen minutes? <sighs> You said no! <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It is the next day. I still got my cornrows. I'm still rocking my cornrows. So, um, what was I about to say? Oh, it's about 8 in the morning. I'm on my way to go get, well, run the track. Um, y'all, I'm so annoyed. I don't know what's going on with my Instagram. Because the last two days I posted on... I post three posts and average on average on my Instagram I get like 20,000 likes which is good for my following and um uh my last post before these two last posts did really good it's still doing really good and then I posted on a Saturday and I'm like what the fuck like I haven't had that amount of least likes in a while 
and then I posted a fire picture yesterday y'all within like an hour I only had 6,000 likes I know it's just like what the fuck like about likes I mean it is about that when like this is like what you trying to do but I don't be tripping but I'm just like what the fuck and it's just annoying sometimes I'm just like what the fuck is going on with my Instagram and I'm ugly like nobody ain't fucking with me like what the fuck so I don't know what's going on with that um but I looked it up I looked up some um what might be happening I might be getting shadow banned or something I don't know um I don't know girl but anyway so I'm on my way to the track and my head looks so big bro um I hate having cornrows and I be looking like a boy but um yeah and later on today today's Tuesday um, yeah yesterday was just not going the way I wanted to I wanted to edit my video post it post a look and I'm just like, ew, like nothing is going right. Like nothing is going right. So, and the video didn't even get approved till 3 a.m. So I'm like, whatever, it's a new day. Yesterday was ugly and gloomy. Today it's all bright and beautiful. So, yeah, so I'm blessed. I woke up today. That's all that matters to have a new day. So, yeah, I'm on my way to the track and about to get it in i actually like doing this but it's so far but whatever and i need to start um i have like all everything that i need for my surgery but i need to get um i think i want to have gauze um and like emergency stuff and then um i already have like arm care and stuff like that pineapple juice i just got that and then i need to get um some gowns and some sports bras compression socks oh and i need to get a new luggage that's what i need to do so yeah i'll probably stop at somewhere but yeah so i'll probably talk to y'all i'll probably check in with y'all later once i start getting that stuff together so Oh, it's actually plenty of people here. <laughs> I was finna show y'all how to get free Starbucks, but the line is just too long for me, sweetie. Mm -mm. <laughs> Cause I'm like dead thirsty right now and Starbucks is right here and I was dead ass finna go there and get some free Starbucks. <sighs> Whatever. But I'm about to stop at um okay y'all, I didn't even tell y'all yesterday, so Yesterday, I had went to Target and Target by closer to my house. They're a little racist. So, mind y'all, I already... Damn, bitch! Did y'all see that car whipping past me? They damn near just hit me. But, um, no. So, mind y'all, we been shopping for toilet... I mean, like, wet ones, antibacterial stuff, whatever, cleaning stuff. So, mind y'all, I been shopping for it. So I know the protocol, like, so I'm getting the wet wipes out the aisle cause I need some more. And I was looking for the to go Lysol things. And the girl that was stocking, she was like, um, you know, it's only one per customer. Cause I was grabbing like three. And I was like, oh, like, I'm not gonna argue with you. Like, and I was like, okay, well, where's the, cause, and there was two brands of wet wipes. It's the Perel one and then this one. And then she was, I was like, well, can I get one from each brand? And she was like, no, you can only get one. I was just like, no, there's no way. Cause them Lysol things at a different Target, I bought three at a time and the wet ones. So you're lying. I was not gonna argue with her. I was not gonna make a scene because girl, it's not the time for that. I'm trying to stay six feet apart away from people anyway. So I wasn't gonna have no, the manager, all type of people come around me. No, no, thank you. So, um, yeah, I'm about to go to the one um, over here in Milwaukee because obviously it's more black. So, yeah, so hopefully today is a productive day. And y'all, while I was um, 
walking and running the track um i was thinking about like you know how i was just came out on here and was like oh my god instagram likes oh my god like i was dwelling on it a little bit but you know i'm growing because I started my platform two years ago, so I don't know. I be, I feel like I'm expected to do more. I don't know. Like it's just, I feel like it's an expectation to beat my numbers every time I post something. But on YouTube, I do good. But Instagram is just a whole different story and a whole different algorithm. So I'm just like, you know what? It's just like any other job. It's like any job. You'll succeed. You'll take a whole bunch of W's. But then them L's that you take, it's just like, oh my God, like, huh. Like, it's so annoying, but you know what? It's like any other thing in life. Any, It's like any other thing in life. You got to just take it how it is and keep pushing, moving forward, and just keep, keep you know, working. So that's what I was thinking about. I was like, girl, don't trip. Just keep working. So, but yeah. But... Yeah, I'm about to go. I'm so thirsty. Um, it's hard looking at this vlog camera because I don't. It's a. I don't know. I'm not. I'm used to like my G7X screen being right there, and is now this is like on the side. So I'm like looking on the side. I don't know, but yeah. So, <sighs> but hopefully today is productive. We get stuff done. I gotta start packing my bags. And I gotta get do one more video today. It's, it's very hard. It's like I'm trying to get content done for um, like next week, <laughs> so I have stuff to upload um, and have those already uploaded before I take off to Miami. So yeah, and then because I'm gonna, I don't want to worry about any editing any other content. I want all my sub. So, uh, sponsorships done. I want all of the content for next week finished um, for YouTube. And then, yeah. And then once I'm back on Instagram, it's gonna be a whole body! New body. You ain't fuck me, you fuck Nicole body. I might damn near start my whole Instagram over, but I, I don't know. We'll see. Oh, I'm so excited! I get a new booty, bitch! I'm so geeked. I'm fucking dying. <laughs> okay, y'all. So, I just got a package from Sephora. So, I'm going to do, like, a little haul, I guess. That reminds me. I need to take that hourglass. Because um, I just got some hourglass. And I need to take that back. But, anyway. So, obviously, I told y'all I was getting the Vanilla Woods. Y'all need to get this perfume. Like, let me open it and see because i have the roller because they don't sell the um the full size in the store they only have the rollers only in certain stores they have it but when i tell you this perfume is like the best perfume ever i'm telling you it's so good so this is how it looks it's so cute super cute the wood cap is super cute and then the black oh my god let me smell it this is best for stress calming soothing of soothing the overworked and no wonder i like this because girl i be feeling overworked okay so but spray oh my god this smells so good you like vanilla scents woody scents this is the scent for you like this is the perfect vanilla scent i swear to you it's not that over girly extra like fruity vanilla like they sell at bath and body works no this is that rich bitch vanilla scent okay i'm telling you go check this out because right now it's my fave and then the other thing that i got my skin has been really reacting bad to any body wash that I use. So I really heard good things about the Nasser, um body care products. And y'all know I love taking care of my skin, my face. I need to start taking care of my body as I do my face. So I wanted to try these products out. So I'll be using the 
body wash by them and this is the fragrance free one and then this these they have different scents but i wanted the fragrance free just because i have sensitive skin and i i know it's like you want to smell good while showering but honestly that's what perfume is for and also i have sensitive skin i can't be putting all these chemicals and stuff on in perfumes and these body washes no so i wanted to try this out and this is how it looks so cute very minimal Lipstick vibes. I love it. I also got the um, body exfoliator. And the one thing that I like about this is that it has the ABH um, acids in it. Just like those peel pads um, that I love from Dr. De Dennis Gross. They have... Um, so basically, it's, this is just like a vitamin for your, your body, basically. This one, the body wash has a whole bunch of vitamins that you need for your body i mean that you need for your skin so basically this is a body wash uh, this is a vitamin vitamin body wash so that's why i wanted to try it and also um and then i got the exfoliator the body exfoliator and then the one thing that i liked about it as i just said the pills are abh with acids and then these have the um Acids in it as well. It has salicylic acid, glycolic acid, and lactic acid. So, and also, I be getting breakouts like on the top of my shoulders right here and on my chest a little bit. Not really, but I'll get like one when I'm about to start my period. But I wanted to try this out. And this is also fragrance free. But yeah, this is how this looks. And I'm going to try this out right now because. I'm about to in the shower, obviously. And then also, I got this Killian perfume. Um, obviously, they don't have this one in the store. So, Brie put me on this because I guess Rihanna put Rihanna wears this perfume. But I didn't want to buy the full version yet because I didn't want to buy an expensive perfume in Haiti. Like, ugh. And then I would have to drive all the way to Chicago and return it. So, yeah. So, I was just like, let me just order the little sample. So, let's smell it right now. And this is the, the perfume Rihanna wears, y'all. So, let's just see. Rich, sexy bitch. That's basically what this smells like. It's definitely a day, um, nighttime smell, and I like that. This is really good. So, yeah, if you want to try this out, make sure you try. It's a Don't Be Shy Love by Killian. So, yeah. I haven't tried the Killian perfumes before, so I'm excited. So, this was a good pickup. So, yeah, that's all that I got from Sephora. Oh, I'm just so happy I got this. I'm happy. I can show y'all what I got at Target. So, like I said, like I just showed y'all, homegirl, homegirl said it. Homegirl said I can't get, I can only get one. But I literally went to another one and they let me get three. Like, stop playing with me. Like, I'm never going to that one ever again. But anyway, so I just got those Clorox wipes just so I can wipe down the plane because, you know, I gotta stay clean. And then, um, wipe down anything. And then also I got a new planner because my other one, I just be plotting, jotting stuff down. And I just got this cute one. It's black and gold. I love black and gold contrast. And then I also got this little envelope thing. Just because when I get sponsorships and stuff, um, I print out what they want me to say and all other stuff. Because I don't feel like coming back to my phone. So I would rather just keep it in this and like receipts and stuff because I gotta save my receipts and then I'll just keep it in here. Like I'll just put this in here for right now. This is for a receipt. Cute. Gotta stay organized. I'm y'all know I'm trying to stay organized. And then I got some more masks because ugh, this one is navy. That's ugly. But yeah, I got some more masks because I be losing mine. So I got black and navy. I want to show y'all the new shoes that I got. They so cute. I know some people probably won't like these, but I'm a croc girl. So I got the Yeezy Foam Crocs. They so cute. And this shoe is so comfortable, y'all. I'm telling you. It is so cute, stylish, and at the same time, comfortable. Like, I just couldn't pass these up. 
so I got them my plug hit me up I mean I hit my plug up and I was like I need them and he got them for me ASAP and then I also got some new Alexander McQueen's because I love Alexander McQueen shoes so I needed some I don't have a white all white shoe this is like a classy girl shoe casual shoe you know what I'm saying so I like Alexander McQueen for that reason and they're also leather so but yeah these are the shoes I just got them in all white and I wear a size 39 Point nine. I wear a size 10. My feet are wide. So if you are struggling on the sizing of these, these are this that's the size that I get. So I actually ordered these from the actual Alexander McQueen website. So and these came super fast. So yeah, that's all I got. So now I'm just about to get in the shower and get to work because I got stuff to do. So yeah. Uh you've been a work week honestly there's not much going on but me trying to get this work done um me trying to get this work done before i go so so i'll probably check in with y'all later i'm really bald <laughs> i really look like a boy but yeah i'll check in with y'all later okay y'all so it's been a couple days and today is well it's going into friday and i'm i'm leaving for my surgery on sunday and today I had to get another COVID test because they wanted it. Before I left, I wanted to make sure I was good before I left, before I got there. Because I'm not going to get there and I all of a sudden, you know, test positive. So, I just got my results back to show you my results. And here we go. Drum roll. What does that say? Not detected, bitch. Final result, eight, seven. I'm so happy. I can cry. Y'all, God is real. I'm so ugly right now, but that doesn't even fucking matter because, bitch, I get my new fucking booty. I get my hips. God is just looking out for your girl. I didn't just cry, but I have a lot of work to do before I head on out. Um, so I still got to do two more sponsorships before I leave. And I got to get those done before Sunday. So, yeah. So, I'm just, I just been stressed out because I was just making sure I was good before I left. And I literally took a Epsom salt bath. Like, I literally had to relax. Like, I literally was stressed. And this just, ugh, I'm so happy. Like, I'm just so fucking happy. And so, we finna get our new ass. And do not come by me because I don't want to catch that shit. No. Mm-mm. Wear your motherfucking mask. Six feet. I'm negative. No. Mm-mm. But, yeah, I'm so happy. And, yeah, so I'm going to go to sleep. It's about 2 o'clock in the morning. I got to get up early because I got to go to my primary care doctor in the morning because she's checking me out because I already did my blood work. But I'm going there tomorrow just so she can make sure everything is, like, good with me and stuff. So, yeah, I'm excited. So, this shit really going to happen, y'all. Oh, my God. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I can't believe this. Okay. I'll talk to y'all in the morning. I'm tired. I'm going to sleep. I'm just so happy. I'm just so excited. Hey, y'all. So, it is the next day. And, um, yes, girl, I woke up today feeling so blessed. Today was a really a busy day. It's going to be busy for the next couple of days for me until um, I leave. But I just woke up feeling so blessed and i'm just so happy because god really works in mysterious ways i'm telling you so i'm a, i really want to like wait okay i feel like everything happens for a reason right so y'all know i had test positive for um covid and y'all know i was really uncomfortable actually going to work um while um during this time because at the end of the day i had to test negative for 
the virus regardless to get surgery so it's just like i'm still going to the hospital risking it and even like you know a month before so i feel like he gave me i know as crazy as it sounds he gave me the virus so i could sit at home and recover and be like and don't catch the virus like at work while working and just for me to stay at home and you know i'm sorry i keep looking at the beat finder just for me to um stay at home and be able to find a primary care physician because i had to find a primary care doctor because if y'all are going to 305 plastic surgery obviously and y'all know that i still go to my job for the insurance and um sorry i don't know how to put my hair and y'all know that i go to my job for the insurance so um and you know you have to fill out fmla when you have a leave obviously so that doctor the doctor that i'm going to he does not sign any papers for you to get off work all they give you is a sheet saying like the girl the receptionist girl probably signs it that's what it looked like a high school wrote it like a high school wrote it or something you know them big fat bubble letters the girls used to write so the, they filled that out and sent it to me but you need to fill out paperwork for my job to me to have insurance and still be on leave so he wasn't filling that out so then i went to my primary care this morning this is my first time i met her i did a virtual call with her before but this is my first time meeting her and if she wasn't finna sign those papers then it was just like i'm not going back to work then because i'm getting my surgery and i don't have i know i don't have enough pto to that's accumulated to have though like a month off of work just from pto so i know this is long but she was able to sign them and i was able to find a primary care which is her she's so nice y'all like everything just went so smooth with her and but now it's crunch time because now <laughs> like girl girl it's crunch time okay because this shit is is about to happen so yeah um but yeah i leave on sunday today's friday i'm on my way to go get a brazilian because obviously i'm not finna you know homegirl i don't want homegirl to be in there hairy okay she needs to be bald because homegirl is finna be it's gonna be something new attached to her, okay? So she gotta make a a good impression. No, just kidding. <laughs> but no, that's nasty to have a bush and that doctor is looking at you like, and then he gonna want to take pictures and stuff. Like that's weird. And my legs are hairy as fuck because of quarantine, obviously. But why are these cars going so slow? Like I just don't understand. But yeah and i have my seatbelt on y'all i'm just i'm just so like wow god really loves me like he really loved y'all y'all have to manifest y'all have to pray y'all have to believe in god y'all have to believe that god is on your side within any anything baby like is anything is possible so and cra it's crazy because oh my god this is so crazy y'all like so hopefully everything just goes smooth, it's smooth sailing from here. I have to go. I still gotta go get some luggage, y'all. I still gotta get stuff, um, like gauze and like um, Coban, like the wrap, and like um, maybe I should get an ice pack. I have that in my fridge, but um, yeah, I gotta get a big suitcase because I'm only bringing one suitcase with all my stuff in it. I need to get like some dresses for me to like just wear um and i gotta see if i can find a robe but yeah so after my brazilian we'll go to the store stop at the store and see if i can pick up a couple things before i head back home because i still have to do some work tonight um because i gotta get two sponsorships done before i leave um edit it i gotta edit this vlog and i gotta edit I'm trying to fill my shower routine tonight, so because I had some sponsorship in it. So, 
I'm excited. Are y'all excited? Oh, we better get a new booty. Booty. <laughs> this shit is crazy. I can't believe I'm finally doing this. Oh my god. It's not really surreal yet. It'll probably get surreal once um I get to the place. But girl, I'm ready. I'm ready to do this. But I'm gonna um but I'll probably talk to y'all once I get out of the Brazilian place. Deep breath, let it go. Good, good. Good, 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 good. Y'all, remind me never to, never to go get a wax and when my shit is on Wildebeest because, girl, I was like, damn, you not done yet? <laughs> that hurt it. Homegirl was ripping me to shreds, okay? But um, it's a TJ Maxx right here. I kind of want to see what they got. I'm trying to get a white robe for this video that I'm filming. I need a, I got a white robe, but I don't like it. It's a little um, worn out. So I really want to get a new one. And I'm also going here and see if I can find one. But, yeah, it's a Ross next door, too. I'm going to go to Ross, too. But I got to make it quick. So I don't want to be in here. I'm not trying to catch that. You know, I'm trying to, you know. But, yeah, let me um just put this, my mask on and stuff. So, I think I'm feeling this. I know I said I wanted a white robe, but this is kind of cute. So, let's see how it looks. So y'all update so okay so I literally scheduled my massages last minute and the girl lady that I wanted to go to she's booked so I cannot make this up so the lady said that she will make an exception for me like what like God is really shining over me right now like he really is like, I really don't know what I did to deserve this. Like, I'm doing everything so last minute, literally. So last minute because, you know, I wanted to be for sure. I had my doubts about a lot of things when it came to this, you know, virus. And I just cannot believe God is really showing out and i just feel so blessed like i just feel so happy i just gotta you know make sure my father god knows how much i appreciate him always okay so i ended up getting um the robe that y'all just seen in the previous clips and i also got the dress to match it's super cute so it's so weird just looking at the camera not the view minor <laughs> but I must be on my way home. I'm about to eat and then um, get to work on my shower routine. And then hopefully y'all enjoy that. And then, yeah, so I'm going to um, check in with y'all once I get to like my shower routine and stuff like that. So. Hey y'all, it's the next day and girl, it's about to be a busy day day so i hope you're up for it because we got a lot to do because i leave tomorrow so y'all i'm really i really want to go to walmart and get one of those seat cover things like a full-blown whole body um seat cover thing for the plane because florida is no joke right now baby so this is what i'm talking about so i posted it on my story and y'all was like go to digs or go to walmart so i'm gonna see if they got it at walmart but first um why do i look so short but first i'm gonna go to um 
Um, where am I going? Oh, to get me some glasses. Wait, the, hold the fuck up. Hold on. I'm on my way to go to the glasses place first. I'm going to try and get new lenses. And, um, yeah, so that's what we're going to, so yeah, that's what we're going to do right now. And then I'm with my mom, so we're going to go to, then I'm with my mama, so we finna go to the stores. I got to get a new luggage because the one that I had, the last time I was in Atlanta, the wheel popped off. So, I got to do all that and then come back home and pack. I'm really, like, it's really nothing to pack. Um, because I'm not going there to be cute. So, um, and that's about it. And then I'm probably going to edit the rest of the night and wake up. And my flight is in the morning. Well, it's in the afternoon, but I'm going to get up early. So, yeah. So, um, so when I get to the eyeglasses place, we're going to try on glasses and yeah, I hope I find a pair that I really like that really frames my face. Cause I'm really picky when it comes to my glasses. Okay, y'all, so it's about that time. I started packing all of my stuff, and I got everything um, today at Walmart. So I'm while I'm packing this suitcase with everything, I'm just going to show y'all what I got. Um, so, yeah, so first, I have my lipo foams, this back thing. My mom ordered all these. I don't know why she got all these off Amazon. Um, what is this? Oh, the sunboard. I told her I had this one. Um, what is this? Girl, she was ordering stuff. And she got a Faja. But this is a small. I know I'm not going to be able to fit that. Company sent me all the stuff. Like, I don't know. We don't need three phones. <laughs> I don't know what she was doing. But actually, you know what? I'm going to set that out because... They also sent me this Faha, but I know my facility is going to give me a Faha, and I heard you can just bring it in. What else did you give me? Some arms, let's see. Um, but yeah, this Faha is from, this is from Cali Curves, Columbia Faha. So, but they're going to give me one, and then also, I'm just going to stay in that. Um, when I get back and then I'm going to order a different one with no compression on my thighs and hips because girl, I need my thighs and hips. So that's the plan, but I'm going to still bring this just in case. So anyway, let's get through this. So the first thing that I got that I don't know if I might need it are these diaper panties or whatever. Because girl, I'm not going to be wearing underwear, just my thigh. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this. So then I also got the pet pee pads for when I'm bleeding. Hopefully I don't bleed that much. Wow, this is already taking a lot of space. Got my compression socks. I got two of them. Compression socks. Don't need them. Um, some coband. Some tape. Um, turmeric tea because I'm definitely gonna need that. Benadryl, some more tape, toothpaste. This is the toothpaste I use. Tylenol, because I'm not gonna be taking any Percocets, unfortunately. Some more. These are the bras that I like, so I just got a pack of three, just so they're easy to put on. They're like little tank tops, so just take the tags off those. Oh, and before I got this new suitcase, and before we even, I'm even putting anything in there, I disinfected it, so. And they also did it at the store. I got some surgical, some more surgical like pads to put over the wounds. Cause I don't know how bad they're gonna be. Some um, laxative, this is kind of TMI, but some laxative, yes, yeah, so I can, is this chocolate? You'll see it, 
how that look i never took a laxative before but i need to make sure i take a number two because then i also got this like it's an antibacterial thing i've seen a lot of girls have it um I just, it's just an antiseptic skin cleaner. So I'm probably clean my body with this before surgery and also the dial. So, my God, I can't believe I'm doing this. This is crazy. Some Allegra. Y'all, we got all of this stuff first because, you know, in Miami, like, COVID is very high right now in Florida. So we don't want to be in the stores that long. We don't want to do all that. No. So... And then I got one gown to wear the whole time because I'm obviously going to be my five. But I just got this t-shirt dress thing that I'm going to wear the whole time probably because I do not care. That's everything. This is all of it. So... Yeah, I don't think I'm going to need anything else. The only thing we got to get still is, um, what do I got to get? Well, I just got to pack my skincare and like body wash and stuff like that. And I'm going to just do it in the morning because we don't leave until 12. So out of Chicago. So that gives us just plenty of time to wake up early and pack everything else that we need. So yeah, but I can't believe I'm doing this y'all like. Oh, let me stand up for this but yeah y'all i can't even believe like i'm doing this right now so say a prayer for me because i am a little nervous but i know god prepared me for this like i've been drinking my green juices taking my vitamins every single day i highly suggest that you do that go watch my video if you have covid 19 whatever and if you're you want to you know recover from it do it suggesting what to do that's what worked for me and yeah so y'all this is crazy <laughs> um but yeah so um so yeah i'm just gonna end the vlog off here and once you see me i'm gonna be a new body you ain't fuck me you fuck the old body you ain't fuck kari you fuck the old body ain't no miles on this new body off with the heads <laughs> so when i see you i'm gonna have a new booty and yeah so anyway so i'm just gonna end this vlog up here and don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i love y'all so much and i'll see you on the flat side <laughs> i'm fucking rolling because the girls in the facebook group they be like i made it to the flat side and it's so funny <laughs> But y'all don't expect to see me uploading, being thirsty, trying to upload my body not even recovered yet. I'm not doing that. I'm sorry. I can't. But I am going to be vlogging everything. Everything. I'm going to vlog everything. And I can't wait. So, yeah, girl. So, let me just end this video off and I'll see y'all in the